Welcome to the Northwest Oil Halftime Report. State Wrestling Day number two, championship quarterfinals. A win here and a win in the semifinals, getting area wrestlers to the state championships on Saturday. Great facial hair from Coach Clum and Coach Abby of Allen East. Start at 120 with their Mustang. Drake Carmine trailing late, gets the escape, but he falls. Over at 106, Antwerp's Aiden Alexander, the back points. He wins the quarters, but loses in the semis 10 to 3. We go to 145, LCC's Joey Caprella, two points here, wins 5 2. He falls in the semifinal 8 to 4. We'll wrestle back later on. How about 195? Bluffton's DeAndre Nasser, the slam and back points, wins here, but falls five to four in the semifinals. Still a chance in the consolations to get top five. How about 145? It is Chase Sumner, the takedown to tie. He falls late, would get a pin in his second match. How about 182? Oh, geez, Daniel Beamer, the first period pin on Patrick Henry's Will Morrow. Beamer wins his semifinal. He's in the finals tomorrow. 285, Coldwater's Thomas Schwederman, the escape but he falls as well. Move to D2 now, 132. Van Wert's Jacob Steyer in escape. He loses to a defending state champion. 145, Bats Colin Mel, pinned by three-time state champ, Mitch Moore of St. Paris Graham. Move to 220 now, Wapakoneta's Evan Keck. The escape here, but he falls. He would win his next match. Finally, Division I, Lima Seniors Naeem Russell, a great escape, but he loses to three-time state champion David Carr, whose dad, Nate Carr, an Olympian, was the FCA banquet speaker here in Lima two years ago. Russell wins his next two matches, so he is two wins away from third place in the state of Ohio.